What's going on YouTube? K-Rob here bringing you some more Sakamoto Days manga reading. Now over the weekend bro, I was so excited to get back into Sakamoto Days bro. I know like we did like a couple chapters last week and we had like all these other mangas that we had to read too and stuff like that. But since the mangas that we are reading like JJK and Blue Lock are on like a week break, tomorrow will be an episode of Nagi reading and we're going to react to the new trailer for the movie that's coming out. But for my Sakamoto Days people, expect a whole bunch of chapter readings for this entire week bro. Thank y'all so much for all the love support y'all been showing me on this channel and on the series bro i highly appreciate every single one of y'all and without further ado let's jump right into sakamoto days all right so we got day 14 stealth mission donden kai headquarters bro i love saying that word donden kai <laughs> So have you heard? It's about the big Donden Kai job right now. Sakamoto's assassination, right? I hear the bounty's crazy high. Yup. Not that it has anything to do with a couple of newbies at the bottom like us. Right. I hear Boyle got taken down. For real? Then I'm out for sure. Hmm? <laughs> You're right. Better to not go looking for trouble. <laughs> nah, trouble came looking for you, bro. <laughs> Yo, look at this man Shin. Yo. Dude. You telling me he didn't kill him? Bro, nah, this is crazy, bro. Hmm? What? <laughs> Infiltration achieved. Huh? You're tossing your jacket? I got bored of it. Hmm. So where's the boss? Oh, come on. Did you pay attention to that movie? It was pricey. The boss is on the top floor. The only way up is the employee elevator, but it's heavily guarded. So how do we get there? From the second floor window, we can climb up the outside like they did in the movie. Right, Mr. Sakamoto? I fell asleep too. <laughs> bro, that shit, that's like one of those... Mission Impossible movies, bro. Eek, it's so high. Shh. He's our ticket in. Hmm? What's going on? There's nobody here. Sheesh. <laughs> what the f Yo, bro. Bro, he got in so smooth. Huh? Ooh. With the taser, bro? Bro. <laughs> Haven't seen you use that in a while. I was having it repaired. Hmm. What's this? <laughs> Who's there? They make this look so easy, bro. Like, who is stopping them from breaking into this place, bro? No one is like, they're not even having a hard time, bro. This is like, this is like second nature to them. This is fun. It's like we're spies. This is no game, stupid. Totally having fun. So far, so good. Well, be careful. Some old buddies might pop up. Five hours earlier at the White Tower. Yo, Nagumo, is it true that you met up with Sakamoto? What the heck? Oh, this looks kind of fancy, huh? Sakamoto? Man, I haven't heard that name in ages. I wonder how he's doing. Don't play me for a fool. You want to die? Hio, that's not important now. The master will be here soon. Bro, hold on. They look kind of official, bro. This this seems a little bit fancy, bro. Who are these people? I know Nagumo, but like the other three? Think I care? I don't trust this guy. Careful now. Let's save the knives for the main dish. <laughs> Some people need to learn to chill, right, Osaragi? Have some water or something. Mr. Shishiba, you might not want to eat that. Head chef, uh, you, you called? Dude! <laughs> Why are there onions in the risotto? Dude. <laughs> I appreciate you all gathering here today. Bro, I'm not gonna lie. If this dude just killed someone over onions in his risotto, I can't imagine what it's like when he's actually in a real fight, bro. Like, this man is deadly. Shishiba? I think that's his name, Shishiba. Oh my goodness. My name is Iria. I am the communications coordinator of the Association of Assassins. It is a tremendous honor to meet the full roster of esteemed order members. Say the full roster. Where are the other four? Well, as for three of them, this is typical, but it ain't normal for old Takamura not to show up. Maybe he's busy. Nah, he's too senile. How old is he again? And the chef's body is still sitting there on the dinner table, bro. <laughs> Let's get down to business. Allow me to present your new assignment as the first line of defense for the association. Recently, an unknown killer has taken out a string of association assassins. There have been more than 30 incidents so far, costing us more than 300 million yen. The association requests that all of you address this matter with the greatest alacrity in the name of the order. Meanwhile, Mr. Sakamoto, something's weird. It's only on this floor, but... I can't hear a single enemy's voice. Is his detector broken again? I heard that. We're here. Oh snap, bro. Hold on, dog. Hold on, hold on. Here we go, y'all. What? Wait, Nagumo? Hey there, Sakamoto. Nagumo. Wow, that's quite the hairdo. Don't those things in your ears hurt? You listening? <laughs> nah, Nagumo's funny, bro. I like his character. Bro, Mr. Sakamoto and Shin get guns. And then Lou gets a water gun, bro. All right, y'all, day 15, initiation. Hey there, Sakamoto. Nagumo. Whoopsie, caught in the act. What are you doing here? Behold, all of the Donden Kai elite, including the boss. I killed them. Dang. Oh, no, bro. <laughs> nah, that's crazy. A solo mission. Nagumo just solo, bro. 
That's crazy. What? Sorry, Sakamoto. I'm afraid you have to die too. What the heck? Huh? Yo. <laughs> Wait. Nah, the shank is crazy though. So fast. Yo. Nah. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Just kidding. Gotcha, didn't I? Bro, it's a fake knife. Bro, nah. This dude, Nagumo, oh my goodness. He did get me. I'm not gonna lie. He got me with that. I just happened to have some business with the Dundon Kai myself. When I got here, they were already dead. Why did you just say that, bro? <laughs> this dude, Nagumo, bro. This dude is a trickster, bro. I swear. That's... This man is funny. I thought he actually, like, shanked them, bro. I'm like, wait, no way that's how Shin goes, bro. Already? Your sense of humor is messed up. God. I'm sorry. Still don't know what to make of this dude. What kind of business? An investigation. A number of assassins have been massacred lately by some unknown perp. Assassins being massacred? What's so unusual about that? Oh, it's common for assassins to fight and kill each other, but this is much more than that. 30 groups with deep ties to the association have been hit, and more than 100 professional assassins have been killed. In just a few months, it's clearly some kind of message to the association. More than 100 killings? It's like a quarter of the assassin industry. The perp always leaves an X at the scene of the slaughter. So we've been calling them X, AKA Slur. We, the orders on the case? Yes, that blind guy said something about the order too. Who are they? The order is a special force within the association. They're the elite killing squad of the assassin world. They're charged with maintaining the order of the assassin world. When friction within the industry is deemed problematic by the association. If Sakamoto and Nagumo are in the association, bro, that just means the others in this group are official as well, bro. I just gotta assume that because there's no way they would have Nagumo and Sakamoto in here and the rest aren't as official as them, bro. Not maybe not more official, but like they're up there just to be on the same squad. You know what I'm saying? As you probably know, Sakamoto here is a former order member. What? I didn't know either. Anyway, Sakamoto, you guys should watch out for X2. We're not assassins anymore. Why should we watch out for an assassin killer? Yeah, we're busy dealing with this dumb bounty issue. This totally throws a wrench in our investigation. Huh, she's totally unfazed by the corpses. Well, I don't know much about it, but I can tell you one thing. The killing started at around the same time the bounty was put on Sakamoto's head. What? Beginning illustration. Anyone can do it. When we view a scene with both eyes, our brains automatically reconcile the different perspectives. It's important to step back from our work to check for symmetry. Hmm, now that I look at it, the balance is slightly off. Wait, this dude is drawing X's with blood from his victims? Oh yeah, he a sick individual. Phew, so in the end, we're back to square one. That was a waste of energy. Gra, where's Sakamoto? You're dead meat, chump. Another one? We've sure had a lot today. This one? No, press the button right next to that one. <laughs> Lou, you're trying to take out the trash. Nope, I'm exempt because I'm playing with Hana today. <sighs> this can't keep happening. It sure is hard getting rid of the bounty thing. Mrs. Aoi, at least we've been selling a lot of band-aids and gauze. Our profits have gone up a bit, so I guess it's fine. Here, I'll put a band-aid on for you. <laughs> Thanks, Missy. Your dad sure is tough. <laughs> All the people that tried to kill him, bro, Hana just comes over and just gives him a band-aid. I'll tell you another thing, Sakamoto. If you had a hard time contending with the likes of Boiled, you're in trouble. Your skills have really atrophied during your five-year hiatus. If we don't know what we're up against, the best thing we can do is get strong enough so that we're prepared for anything. In other words, rehabilitation. <laughs> Yo, what the heck? Whoa, you're early today, Hana. We stayed under the speed limit. Well, good for you. I've got to do my part. In order to better support Mr. Sakamoto, what I need is to further hone my mind reading skills. Gosh, what a long list. Here you go. What? Creepy. Wow, they're both really working hard. I want to do something too. You're stronger when you're drunk. You should just drink all the time. Huh? Really? That's it. My training. It's a drink like a fish. Oh, nah. <laughs> that's, that's crazy, bro. They're going to turn her into an alcoholic for sure. One pork bun, please. <laughs> Coming right up. Lou, how did they know? Sure, you're bleeding copishly from your forehead. Eek! No, Shin, here's a bandage. <laughs> Toy corner. Oh, I like this. Can I scare someone with this? <laughs> Nagumo, bro. That dude is funny, man. I like Nagumo. Nagumo's probably like up there with one of my favorite characters. I'm not gonna lie. I like Shin too. Shin and Mr. Sakamoto are definitely. Like, I say they're tied for one, bro. And then Nagumo, bro. Nagumo for sure. Nagumo gotta be up there, bro. He definitely gotta be up there. All right, y'all, day 16, department store war. Limited edition sugar backpacks. Be the most popular kid in your class. Wow. Mama, know what? When I go to school, I really, really want a sugar backpack. But those are limited edition, sweetie. Limited edition? They're probably really popular and hard to find. 
What? It's me. Yo. Are we going shopping at a department store today, Mr. Sakamoto? This isn't just shopping. This is a crucial mission. Acquire backpack for Hana. Mission priority, acquire backpack. Oh, right. Hana's starting grade school soon. Time sure flies. Soon she'll be in junior high. Guys will start hitting on her. No, that's going too far. Even if it's in your head. Gotcha. A super rare limited edition backpack. So that's why you put in that call to an informant. Well, we'll be sure to get one. Hey, look, that must be the backpack section. Huh? Back to school event. Bro, that is so true, bro. I remember like going back to school and like going school supply shopping and stuff. And we would do it so late that like there would literally be no supplies left, bro. It would literally be like this, like the, like the mad dash last second, bro. Everyone would be going crazy. Attention shoppers, we only have a limited number of sugar backpacks. There are only 20, no pushing, please. Nice and move. Out of my way, you're dead meat, you turd. <laughs> it was literally like this, bro. <laughs> Look at them. Look at Mr. Sakamoto and shit in the back, bro. <laughs> what? What the heck? Whew. Are you two here for those backpacks too? Look, for your own good, don't bother. Those sugar backpacks are top of the line character backpacks. Everybody wants one. Parents all over Japan are risking life and limb. Getting one for your kid is the highest status symbol a parent can. Let's go. Right. <laughs> Hey, bro. No, this is funny, bro. This is funny. What? Move. <laughs> bro, the old ladies are throwing elbows and stuff. You old hag. Was that an elbow? Don't underestimate granny's kiddo. <laughs> I have to get that backpack for my grandchild. My precious baby, don't worry. Mama's gonna get one for you no matter what. As a backpack otaku, I must have one for my collection. Everyone's thoughts are so loud. My head's splitting. The determination is too intense. <coughs> Move. When it comes to my kid, nobody's more determined than me. Wow, you've got quite the aura. This tubby could be a real contender. For better or worse, there's only one left. <laughs> Yo, bro. Mr. Sakamoto, drop the backpack, fatso. Hand it over, Porky. Wow, he's pretty tough. Kill. Bro, I can't breathe. Sakamoto flashes back to his assassin training when he had to fend off a school of bloodthirsty sharks at a depth of a hundred meters. Ah! <laughs> Yo, he won though. Give this to Hana, Mr. Sakamoto. You still haven't paid for it. Huh. You win, big boy. What a man. If I were five years younger, I'd date him. <laughs> Those gradies were really something. I have a point card. Gah! Huh? What? Huh? Hey, I'm sorry. Yikes. <laughs> Excuse us. Dude, nah, this manga is too comedic, bro. This is funny. I like this, man. Oh, goodness. What a lively young person. Mr. Sakamoto? Where is it? I've never seen him this desperate. Mr. Sakamoto, why are you doing this to yourself? When I go to school, I really, really want a sugar backpack. It's a girl, sweetie. Here, take her. Me? But I don't... Come on. Yo. Aw. Dude. And that right there is when Mr. Sakamoto's life changed, bro. His daughter changed him for real, bro. Like, yeah, Mr. Sakamoto changed him, but like, it was at that moment, as soon as he got a kid, everything, the brain chemistry just did a flip, bro. No way, are you crying? When she laughed, it was like a flower bloom. <laughs> it's not like you to wax poetic. Well then... How about we name her Hana because her smiley face is a flower? Gosh, now I really get how much <laughs> Mr. Sakamoto cherishes Hana. Oh, Mr. Sakamoto, it landed on that railing. <laughs> Yo, dude. Nah, he'll do anything to get that backpack, bro. Don't even matter. Huh? Mr. Sa- <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Mr. Sakamoto, that big guy's crazy. All of that just for a backpack? My daughter wants it. Nothing matters more than that. Taro Sakamoto, the legendary father. <laughs> yup, and she got that backpack too. Yup, look at that. Yup, I can't believe you managed to get one of those backpacks. Wasn't it hard? <laughs> He's bandaged up. I happened to find one at the first shop I tried. <laughs> Is that so? Hey, girly. Huh? Nice backpack. Looks great and you're cute. Wanna be my girlfriend? My name is Hana. Hey, bro. The boss seems irritated today. He's been polishing his gun ever since they got back from Hana's first day of school. Sweetie, you have to let her go. Kazuko 70, Barber Strong, Sachiko 68, Clothing Store Owner Strong. 
closed for a family camping trip. Good morning. Come on in. Gosh, we haven't been camping in a while. Hana is going to catch a fish. It says they have zip lining. I've never been camping. Noonish arrive at campsite. Wow, this place is huge. I want to go fishing. What a huge zip lining course. Cool. Yummy. Well, should we get to bed? Sakamoto staff takes the day off. Yudo Suzuki, ever since I've started drawing this manga, my search history has taken a violent turn. Kill with ballpoint pen, assassin weapons, killing fundamentals, <laughs> bullet mechanism, how to hold a gun. Bro, Yudo Suzuki's search history must be insane, bro. What in the world? All right, y'all, day 17, Haisuke Mashimo. Pisuke, it costs 20,000 yen a month to feed you. Pee! I've been feeding myself on 2,000 yen a month, but I'd really like to fill my belly for once, yo. You know, all of our problems will go away if we kill this Sakamoto guy, right, Pisuke? Pee! I mean, a billion yen? If we had that much money, I bet we could even eat sushi. Sheesh, all these assassins after the bounty have been totally destroying the shop. We need a major renovation, but we don't have the funds. On the other hand, if we win this tournament tomorrow, it'll fix everything. Yo, excuse me. Welcome. This is Sakamoto's, right? Where's Taro Sakamoto? Yeah, bro, he just walked in asking like that. That's crazy. A new assassin? If you hand him over and don't give me any trouble, I'll let you live, tubby. You're talking to Mr. Sakamoto, buddy. I just work here. I don't know Taro Sakamoto. What? Wait, isn't this Sakamoto's? Yeah, but we have lots of locations. Lots of locations? What a dopey assassin. He doesn't even realize he's talking to Mr. Sakamoto. Also, I didn't know there were lots, yo. His thoughts are so stupid. Reading his mind is a total waste of energy. No, wait. That lady in the street said Taro Sakamoto is here. Don't you know when to bug off? First of all, there's probably 200,000 Taro Sakamotos in Japan. That many? I'll never be able to track down that many dudes, yo. How much train fare would that even cost? I don't even have breakfast money today. <laughs> he's staring at us. Thank you guys, for real, yo. We're super lucky to get these pork buns, right, Pasuke? There are some really dumb assassins out there. Believe it or not, those are the ones who tend to survive. Remember that. Shoot, that went nowhere. Guess we're still stuck living in this tent. And it's on its last legs. The special tent my granny gave me. <sighs> One of these days, we're gonna strike it rich and live in a big house together, yo. Pee! You're not cut out to be an assassin. Give it up, loser. Those dudes who fired us. We'll be sorry for that, yo. No, my home! Dang. What's this? An airsoft tournament. The grand prize is a million yen? Yo! We could buy an apartment if we had that much, right? Pasuke, our luck is changing, yo. Pee! The next day. Let's win that grand prize. One million yen. Teams, pick up your wireless transmitters here. Cool. Hey, it's the PRC 152. I wanted to check out the sound quality on these. Chill out. You've got this. You should play too, Lou. I don't like violent games. I told you, it's not allowed. Yeah, but, oh no, please, I wanna play, yo. You have to enter as a team. Ugh, him again. Oh, God, he's looking at us. Please help me. Leave us alone. We don't accept solo participants. Only teams of two to five. Two to five? <laughs> Thank you, guys. He's gonna slow us down. It's the day you've all been waiting for. The annual Ikorazaka Shopping Arcade Airsoft Tournament. We're using airsoft bullets that splatter blue on contact. One hit and you're out. The entire shopping arcade is your playing field. Shoot all you like. We'll all clean the shopping arcade together at the end. It's a big help each year. Oh, I get it. This doubles as an annual cleaning event for the shopping arcade. And there's prize money. Win-win. Okay, so what do I do? Just shoot the other teams and shut up. <laughs> all right, everyone, take your positions. What's with them? <laughs> Must be noobs. Ready, set, go! They won't last long. Yo. Yo. Bro, no, this dude is a dead shot, bro. This dude is dead, bro. Dead. No. He's an assassin with with a with a with a bullseye on his cheek, bro. He had to been official, bro. He had to been something official. That is so crazy though. Like he has no work though. Bro, he's he's a homeless assassin, bro. That's actually insane. No one is hiring him. What? He shot them? Huh? She said go, right? <laughs> Team Sakamoto's off to a roaring start. Owie. Dang, they're good. That jerk. Ha. <laughs> they're wide open. Uh. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Sakamoto. <laughs> Bro, nah, this team is goaded, bro. Bro, Shin Sakamoto and Hisuke? Oh my goodness. 
<laughs> they gotta remind us, bro, that these are airsoft guns. Wow, Team Sakamoto is good. They're the favorites for the prize money so far. We can do this. With a million yen, we can outfit the shop with bulletproof glass and increase the kinds of ramen we carry. This is so fun. So this is what they mean by war buddies. Wow, this is great. No one I have friends who've got my back, yo. Great. Now we're his friends. Bro, yeah, so when they win, how are they gonna are they gonna even split this money? Cause he wants this money for something totally different than what Shin and Mr. Sakamoto wants it for. You know, you guys are really good, yo. Wait a sec. Are you guys he's on to us? Airsoft geeks? Good thing he's dumb. <laughs> okay, I'll go out in front and draw their fire. I know you'll back me up, my brothers. <laughs> well, he doesn't seem like such a bad guy. Team Sakamoto is unstoppable. That's the famous Taro Sakamoto for you. Just look at his beautiful flappy flesh. <laughs> is she drink? Bro, is Lou drinking? Oh my goodness. Taro Sakamoto? But no way. They look nothing alike. <laughs> that was the boss when he was skinny. But I like him better chubby. See? Same glasses, same hair. <laughs> There's no resemblance at all. Right, Mr. Sakamoto? Right. Yo, what's this? Team Sakamoto's bringing up? I hate liars. Yo, airsoft cuts. <laughs> Alright y'all, day 18 versus Sniper. Just as the action is heating up in the Ikorazaka Shopping Arcade Airsoft Tournament, what's this? Looks like a falling out on Team Sakamoto. You'll pay for this. I thought we were friends, yo. Dang it, Lou. That's the famous Taro Sakamoto for you. Why'd you have to go and run your mouth? Well, it's all for the best. I'll get the prize money and the bounty. You're wide open, Team Sakamoto. You're going down. Whoa, a surprise attack by Team Barber. Oh, who's that? Nice timing. Ow! Come, Pisuke. Wait, what? Wait, did his bird just bring in the actual gun? Enough with the airsoft gun, yo. A rifle? This is more like it. Yo. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Wait, did he just deflect a bullet with his bare hand? From that distance and position, he got a perfect beat on Mr. Sakamoto's head. Dude, that's crazy. Gonna give me a run for my money, huh? Let's get some space, Pasuke. Pee! Wait up, Shin. This first. Well, heck, I didn't expect to find our target so close to us, yo. We're really lucky. Pee. Hmm, what is it, Pasuke? <laughs> Crying? Me? No way, I'm not sad at all, yo. Me and those guys are enemies, right? <laughs> Besides, this is how it has to be for me to prove myself as a proper assassin, yo. This is it, folks. The climax of the tournament. Who will win the grand prize? He doesn't seem to be close by. Okay, I'm gonna go track down that jerk. Wait, a fight with a sniper requires extra care. We have to suss out his location without revealing ours. Dude. Oh my goodness, bro. A ricochet shot. Where'd that come from? He knows our location? Oh, the bird is tracking them. For real, Pitsuke? He dodged it. Not bad. I'm surprised you managed to evade that. Yeah, right. That was just a fluke ricochet. Quit acting big. Fluke? That was no fluke. Huh? That bullet had an unusual rate of rotation. Like, it was meant to ricochet. You can tell? That's impressive. Yeah, they're called triple rebound bullets. They're specially designed to ricochet so that their path is hard to read, yo. Well, so much for friendship, huh? You seem pretty determined to kill us now. Don't give me that crap. First and foremost, we're assassins. <laughs> Yo, I'm still crying, bro. When I look through the scope of my rifle, all I see is a target. Dude. Whoa, that dude's merciless. Oh my goodness, bro. Wait, this dude's actually good with the rifle, man. They're really hanging in there. You can't do anything, can you, Haisuke? My whole life, I was bad at lots of stuff. But for some reason, I've always been a pretty decent shot. This is it. This is all I've got. After graduating from the Assassin's Academy. Hello, I'm the new hire, Haisuke Mashimo. My specialty is sharpshooting. At the Academy, I spent all my time honing my sniping. One kill a day. You can count on me to be the best at sniping. I look forward to working with you. What kind of pitch is that? Who needs an assassin with only one skill? Since when do noobs get to pick and choose their assignments? What are you doing, Mashimo? Can't you even use a knife, you idiot? Mashimo, you always mess everything up. I'm gonna kill you. You're not cut out to be a hitman, for real. If all you can do is sniping. Do yourself a favor and quit, you loser. I didn't belong. Soon afterward, they fired me. Hmm, Taro Sakamoto, bounty of 1 billion yen. Hmm, I'll do it. And I'll prove the worth of an amazing sniper. When I pull off this job, I'm finally gonna- Shut up, quit talking to yourself with your mic on. Wait, you can hear me? <laughs> He can read his mind through the- Bro, that's so funny. First of all, what does it matter what other people think of you? Huh? 
Basically, if you believe in yourself, that's all that matters. Yo! <laughs> Over there, the thought waves of a startled person stand out even from a distance. Oh, that's that's smart. Wait, that's smarter shit. Wait, what? Rats, the old loud noise attack. Clever. Now my ears are ringing. Huh? Wait, what the heck? Yo! <laughs> he destroyed my rifle. With the rock? Is he even human? I'm no match for this guy, bro. He just threw a rock through the barrel of his rifle and just destroyed it completely. That is insane, bro. From that distance, too. Today's ferocious battle finally comes to a close. The winner of the 52nd annual airsoft tournament is Team Sakamoto. Bravo. I'm a failure, even as a sniper. Damn it. You sure cry a lot. Are you really an assassin? Shut up. You guys don't know what it's like to be weak. Weak. I've never gone up against such an incredible sniper in my life. You think saying that makes me feel any better, yo? Do you have to cry over every little thing? Here's your share of the prize money. 50 yen? All your shooting wrecked the town. If only I had 50 yen. So many treats. Well, there y'all have it, y'all. Day 14 to day 18 of Sakamoto Days, bro. Very, very entertaining, bro. I really enjoyed those last couple chapters with that assassin, bro, Hensuke. Crazy to think, though, that... People don't want a one-trick pony as an assassin, bro. Especially a sniper. You know what I'm saying? Like, that dude seems like the type of person that would get a job done from a distance. Like, you will never have to see his face, bro. You know what I'm saying? But they didn't want someone that was just a one-trick pony, which is kind of weird, bro. I personally, if I was hiring a hitman, bro, I would have hired him, bro. Even if he was just a one-trick, bro, I would have just been like, yo, you're good at sniping? All right, cool, bro. You're hired. Like, you can get the job done from a distance. You don't got to be all up close and personal, bro. That's fine. Yeah, W chapters, bro. We got to see the order as well a little bit. Like we got we got to see a couple of other members from the uh, from the order, which is pretty cool. W chapters, y'all. If y'all did enjoy the chapters, please do like, share, and subscribe, bro. I highly appreciate y'all so so much, bro. Y'all stay cheerful, stay motivated, and stay blessed, y'all. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one. Peace.